أشهد أن لا إله إلا الله أشهد أن محمد رسول الله حي على الصلاة حي على الفلاح قد قامت الصلاة قد قامت الصلاة الله أكبر الله أكبر لا إله إلا الله السلام عليكم um, Welcome to Nashville International Academy um, My name is Berthina Naba McKinney I'm the principal of the school I want to welcome you um, as a new prospective parent or someone who is interested in the school um, I want to have you take a snapshot of the school and all the things that we have to offer here inshallah um, as you look at all the features that we have and look at the interviews that our teachers offer, um, also keep in mind and in consideration um, that we are the only Islamic school in the Middle Tennessee area, and we would love to have you join us, um, inshallah. Um, as we look at NIA throughout the, the years and throughout the progress, we have started, originally started the school in 1995 um, and have progressed to now. We started out with portables and now we're into an actual school building um, by the grace of Allah. Alhamdulillah. I'm Muhammad Hafiz and I'm in seventh grade. I recently went to a public school and I converted to this virtual Islamic school. I feel safer, better environment, better community. Uh, I get to spread my views more freely because I don't feel criticized. I talk Arabic, they don't look at me like I'm weird. And I enjoy being here because there's not weird people, weird, they're not doing weird things. So I feel fine with this community and school. I'm one of the one of the math teachers. I teach here uh, third grade through sixth grade, and uh, I love my subject. I, I would love I would love my students to love the math because they use it for everything they do in their life. Everything you do in your life, shopping, grocery, you do when you buy a home, when you calculate your tax, everything with every step you need math, and that's what we're trying to do to build the skills in order to be successful and build connection with their life. Nia is the best school. Our favorite subject is math. Math, you do their games. You got too many skills. You can do ever as good. You it can help you with your life and everything else. My name is Samia, and Nia is a very good school. My favorite subject is science, and the best thing that happened to me is when I won, won third place in the science fair. Working at NIA is just a really great experience. I love the staff, I love the students, I love the NIA family, I love the curriculum here. All around, it, it's Dawa, Dean, and Providence all in one place. In class, they have activities, there's games. For instance, the one on um, early settlement of the state of Tennessee actually has kids' clothing that children of that day and time would have worn. It has different things people would have used. I teach third through sixth grade language arts, reading, and third and fourth grade social studies, and today we're also doing art.
انهم كفوا بس وما هو بالحص انهم يقيد الله الله سبحانه وتعالى سند ا هولي بوكس رايت هاو ماني هولي بوكس الله سند فايف اوكي دو يو نو ذا نيمز اوف ذا بروفيتس يس اوكي احمد ابراهيم هاز وات 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 بوك صحه صحه هاو ابوت سيدنا داوود عليه السلام زبور زبور هاو ابوت سيدنا موسى عليه السلام تورات هاو ابوت سيدنا عيسى عليه السلام انجيل How about the last book? Muhammad. Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. What is this? Quran. Five holy books. Okay, what is the message inside the whole, those holy five books? There is no God but Allah. And Muhammad, no, there is no God but Allah. And what else? You have to be good. good. You have to share. You have to be nice person. No, no, no fighting, no hitting, no lying, no cheating, right? That was all the whole thing. bad words. No bad words, yes. That's right. Okay, are you ready for calling now? Yes! Okay, let's do that. Okay. Adam, this is your book. Told us. Told us. These books. These books. To. To. Share. With. Each. Each. What? Me. Speak the truth. Poor, poor, and needy. Be, be fair. من من ال الآباء والإخوة الذين يسكنون في أمريكا أن يشجعوا أبنائهم على الالتحاق بهذه المدرسة. التي هي ما شاء الله من أحسن المدارس التي أعرف عنها أو أعرفها ف يعني فيها مزايا كثيرة وهي أنها تجمع بين التراث الإسلامي العربي والحياة والثقافة الأمريكية المعروفة في أوساط كثير من الأمريكيين شكرا School, if you have children that are very low level in Arabic or you want to teach them more about Islam, this is the place to uh, uh, get them started and um, to inshallah have a good goal and future and a peace, peaceful time when they grow up. Bismillah uh, ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Ahmed Ragab. I am the Arabic and the social studies and the Islamic studies teacher for fifth and sixth grade. Uh, I would like to welcome you here in the school. Um, the question is, why this school, not uh, any other school? Why NIA? The importance of uh, having uh, your s uh, child here in NIA, I believe, is uh, in the integration, uh, the integration between all subjects and Islam. Like, for example, if they have uh, American history uh, class. Uh, we can make an integration between the American history class and to compare it with the Islamic history as well. So that will enrich their um, understanding of their identity and make it um, even deeper in their personality. Uh, the second thing which I believe that no other uh, weekend school, uh, Islamic weekend school, can compete with the NIA in this matter is the continuation. Like, for example, if we teach Islamic studies as Salah, for example, how to pray, uh, in the weekend school it will be for one hour only a week. But here it's every day, every day we pray Dhuhr and Asr, and in the week we pray Friday prayer. All the lessons that they get in the Islamic studies, we make sure that they apply it. So it's not only a theoretical kind of lessons, but we make sure they, they practice it to be part of their personality. And this is with the importance, and I don't think that any Islamic school, weekend school, can compete with a regular Islamic school uh, in this matter. Uh, the third thing, which is very important, is the environment. The environment when you have your, your son or your daughter in, in, in an Islamic environment that uh, they see all the teachers wear hijabs, the, the female teachers wear, wear hijab, 
they pray, all their colleagues and the peers uh, around them, wear, the, the, the girls wear hijab. So it will be part of their culture. They would not feel any kind of resistance to, for her to wear hijab and for him to see uh, his sister to wear hijab or for him to pray in public. So this matter, I believe this is, these are the, the most important three things to choose NIA over any other school in the United States of America. Thank you. يعني فعلا المدرسة لها لها تأثير إيجابي خاصة بال يعني أنا يكفيني أن يكون بجانب ابني عبد الرحمن وعبد الله وعمر وعبد الله يعني الاسم لوحده يكفي يعني بدل ما يكون جيم وجيمس الله أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر أشهد أن لا إله إلا الله أشهد أن لا إله إلا الله أشهد أن محمد رسول الله أشهد أن محمد رسول الله Today's khutbah is prepared by fifth grade. And this will be, inshallah, a tradition. Every khutbah I will give, one of the classes will prepare it for me. Of course, I will add some things, I will change some things, but at the end it will be their khutbah. So the day, today's khutbah is fifth grade hub. Okay? They want to talk about the judgment day. Yawm al qiyam And the importance of believing in Yawm al qiyam the judgment day. Any Muslim who does not believe in the day of judgment is not following the sixth article of faith there are articles of faith any muslim has to believe has to believe in the first article of faith is to believe in allah the second one is to believe in his angels third one to believe in his books fourth to believe in his messengers fifth to believe in the judgment day Fifth, to believe in the destiny and to believe in the judgment day, the sixth or the fifth one. So, believing in the judgment day is one of the six pillars of Iman or faith. If any person does not believe in any of these articles, he is not a Muslim. He cannot be a believer. My name is Warida Farrokh and I am currently a board member and a parent in Nashville International Academy. I have also taught here for a couple of years, I'm currently teaching in public school. And this is an effort for all the new parents to send their kids to uh, NIA. And I just want to help in uh, sending the message across that my experience at NIA has been great as a teacher, as a parent, and as a board member. And I think it's um, our community which needs to come together to encourage uh, the, the whole project and the idea which is behind Nia. We need to send our kids here. It's good for them because uh, they learn uh, their identity, where they belong in the society. And Nia helps them in becoming uh, confident in what they believe and how to contribute in, their, in the society in future. And I think uh, it's about time that we get together. Assalamu alaikum. This is Sister Yasmin. I'm the administrative assistant here at NIA. Uh, NIA is welcoming you and your children for the new year, inshallah. Um, we're all hopeful that we're going to have a great year, 2012-2013. Uh, this is a safe environment. 
and a good place for your uh, students to come and study as long as to learn all about their religion, uh, learn Arabic as a second language or first language. Um, we offer a lot of programs, after school activities. Basically, NIA is the place to be for your children. Hope you join us at NIA because it's a great